Hello Aquarius, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot. Whoa, goodness. Um, and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of um, January 28th through February 4th, 2018. The cards I'm using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I'm closing off with my, hmm, I guess I will use my Spirit Song Tarot, okay? Um, I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. Alright guys, let's get this show on the road. What's going on with the Aquarius? Aquarius, Aquarius, Aquarius. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Alright. Alright. Oh, first card we got here is the telepathy card. Reverse. Um, this card represents me. I feel like somebody may be, um, having issues like there is no grown-up activity going on or somebody may be having grown-up activity outside of the relationship okay all right yeah so yeah i feel like somebody's thinking about leaving because of no um grown-up time or somebody's leaving because of the grown-up time outside of the relationship okay All right, so we got the moon card here. So it seems like I feel like somebody feelings about this whole situation is getting ready to come out. But also, let's see what this moon is about. Give me one card for this moon. One card, please, for the Aquarius. All right, yeah, so it seems like all this stuff is getting ready to come out pretty, pretty soon, okay? If it didn't come out already. All right, yeah, so it seems like somebody's watching someone. All right, so I feel like somebody, the reason why somebody is not getting a grown-up activity um, and, and feel like whoever's um, dealing with somebody in a grown-up way outside of the relationship is getting ready to be caught, okay? And they about to be caught because the other party is stalking. All right. All right, so it seems like um, either somebody been thinking about leaving the situation or um, this activity on the side only been going on for um, a couple weeks, a couple months. Okay, I'm going to just say like at least three months. All right, so we got the receptivity card here reversed. <coughs> Oops, excuse me. Um, yeah, so it seems like somebody's just not getting what they need at home, so they're going to get it from outside. Um, so I feel like the person at home is trying to give, but I feel like this person just wants something from outside. Um, the person that is left at home not cheating is now resorting to um, stalking to try to get um, get some answers. Somebody wants some answers here. All right, so we got the Homeland card here. Um, so this card makes me feel like, yes, yeah, somebody has had enough. They found what they were looking for, okay? So I feel like when it comes to somebody dealing with grown-up activity on the outside, somebody seen that or just somebody just had enough um, being with somebody who doesn't want to um, take care of them in a, in a grown-up way, all right? All right, so we got the mirror card here. This makes me feel like somebody was trying not to think about and believe this for uh, quite some time, okay? And then out of the blue, they just decided, like, okay, let me let me go see what's going on here, okay? But, of course, somebody's blaming they self at first, but then I feel like somebody's going to snap out of that very quickly and, um end the story or move on or just start asking questions all right all right so let's go let's see what's going on i think these cards are a little bigger than yes they are or i i just didn't use them that much so no bending activity going on here all right so what's going on with the aquarius Aquarius, 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 what's going on, what's going on, what's going on? All right. 
All right, so we got the seven of feathers here. I believe the feathers are wind, um, air sign. Okay, so we got the seven of swords here. So I want to make sure. Let me make sure because I know the acorns are fire. Sorry, guys. I wasn't, I wasn't ready. Let me see. Feathers. Yeah, feathers mental. So this is definitely... Um, swords okay so it seems like somebody's being very fake and sneaky going on here all right so we got the eight of, of feathers so it seems like somebody is getting ready to let go somebody's letting go of a situation that's uh, mentally holding them back okay somebody is about to break free out of this cage all right so it's crazy because it seems like somebody was leaving someone at home believing that there was going to be something but not acting like they were going to be something okay and it seems like by by somebody stalking or, or investigating, they're finding out like why this person isn't giving me the time. And it's because somebody's getting ready to move on. Go somewhere else with someone else. All right. So, dang it. All right. So, we got the king of crystals here. So, crystals has to be uh, pinnacles. Well, I think it is. But... Um, the King of Pentacles here, so I feel like somebody is working on their loyalty, okay? Or somebody was supposed to be loyal, but I feel like that's why the Seven is here. So it seems like somebody could have possibly been acting like they were going to work or acting like they're going to school or acting like they're going to take care of a parent or whatever, but in reality, they were going to do some funny business outside, okay? All right. Mm-mm. All right, so we got the four of feathers here. So it seems like, yeah, somebody's in real deep thought about what they're getting ready to try to do. But what's crazy about this is the four represents um, like somebody trying to recover something to me. Okay, so it seems like somebody's getting ready to try to recover uh, this relationship. But I feel like it's this disloyal person. Somebody's acting like they're going to um, be the person that they were trying to be. And I feel like, of course, once you caught red handed, uh, them crocodile tears start coming down. Okay. You just try anything you can to try to make everything go away. Okay. But it's crazy because when this person does convince you to let them stay or to come back, then they're going to leave for this other person because they was only crying because they got caught. Okay. All right. Let's see what this seven of pinnacles, seven of swords, seven of feathers on the card, please. All right. So we got the seven of acorns. So acorns are wands, I believe. I'm going to check it out. Because what we got next acorns I'm sorry guys I just love these I just had to use them but I was not ready okay yeah acorns air are okay crystals yep crystals are earth yep acorns Okay, yeah, I was right. Just had to make sure. I'm sorry. I'm one of those people, like, when I go to school, I like to check things three, four, five, six, eight times just to make sure something's correct. Oh, my God. You can't even tell me to count money. I'll be there for days on $1,000. I just kind of over, over, over. Okay, so back to the story. So we got the seven of acorns here, which is the seven of wands, and it's reversed. So it seems like, yes, yeah, somebody's just not willing to fight for this trickery anymore. But I feel like when this person gets caught, they're going to try to recover stuff just like I was feeling. And then they're going to take off. Okay. I feel like it might buy another three months by catching them. Maybe even three weeks. Maybe three weeks. I heard three. I don't see any threes up here, but I heard three. So it might die by three weeks, three months. Okay. But I'm pretty, or it could be three days. I'm feeling shorter though. All right. Let's see what this King of Crystals one card, please. 
All right, so we got the Knight of Shells here. So that's only four things. So shells got to be cups, right? So we got the Knight of Cups. Like I was saying, this disloyal person is going to try to come um, act like they're ready for a relationship. Be, try to be more compassionate. Try to be there for you. Um, try to act like they're going to change. They're going to stop. I mean, we got the overall with the Seven of Swords. This person is not going to do that. They just don't want to lose. It's just a... Being caught is what's making them freak out like that. All right, let's see what this four feathers is about. One card, please, for the Aquarius. All right, the shaman. So I believe the shaman is the high orphan. Okay, but we just basically like. We're going to read this one, guys. All right, we got the Hermit reversed here. So it seems like somebody's coming out of some kind of de uh, depression. I feel like out of this whole conversation. But the Shaman. Sorry, anybody who started off with me know I, I can't read that good. But I love to try to read out these darn books. Okay, because... Even though I'm psychic, I know a lot of what's going on with the messages. I also want to incorporate um, the meanings of what the people who wrote these books and made these beautiful cards um, would like to say. Oh, okay. We're not going to get that lucky because I don't want to waste you guys' time. So I'm going to just do it intuitively. Nope. Oh, I feel so bad. Alright, so I'm sorry too. Because I should know what a shaman is, but I really don't. But I sort of feel like it's just someone who blesses things. If you guys want to give me a lesson and let me know what that means, I'll be okay. I would I would love you guys to help me learn some things. I love learning stuff. Um But this just makes me feel like somebody needs to be more um patient and focused on what they're doing i feel like somebody is getting ready to start making some wise decisions um i feel like somebody is being compelled to make a decision over what's going on over everything that's happening okay but i feel like of course this is just one of those uh hail mary decisions where you see that something's going on and you feel like it's the right thing and it's just Somebody's just trying to do this to to recover the situation. Somebody's trying to be and act like the best person. Okay. I feel like, yeah, somebody just don't want to be the one to get left. They want to be the lever, okay? All right, but, you know, if you guys got anything about the shaman, you can definitely let me know. I would love to um, hear from you on that. Other than that... That's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Um, I'm going to go read this book, and thanks for watching.